Comes with a battery. Yeah. And another battery. The Econo Power did not make it. <laughs> and in a Fiero, we go to get another jet boat. We're off on another adventure. No boat behind us yet. Dude, it's getting really good mileage. You just clipped off five gallons. Yeah. It's like 200 miles on this tank. No way. It's full. Well, if you just left it, it would have been flat $17, but uh, Dude, you want cents in the car. What would it be? Six gallons for 190 miles. Whatever that is. It's, it's pretty good. Four more gallons in the car it's tank. pretty good. Yeah. I'll see if I can get it up to all the way to six gallons. Oh, There we go, we got six gallons of eighteen dollars. That is getting way better mileage since O one fixed it and put a O2 sensor in it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, next stop, we'll see you guys in the boat. Say bye to one. Bye bye. Now you gotta show the camera you got to uh, uh, here we go in a Fiero to go get a boat. Okay, we are looking for a jet boat. In the drive, we we're looking for 7224. Yeah. And that's 7-1. Are they going up or down? Can't tell. 7160. Are the numbers going up? Uh, that one behind us is 7 I don't, That one didn't have a number. We're about to find out. 7176. Yeah, so yeah, they're going up. They're going up. Okay. So we should be. That's 200 more feet. Sunflowers. So we're looking for a jet boat, guys. In the driveway, the next to the driveway. There's the 7-2, so now we just got my own. That's eight. Anyways, it was a good drive down here. Listen to a whole bunch of music. What do you want to bet? It's where the extension cords and the old Dodge Trump car. Uh, that's what I'm oh, thinking. it is. Right there. Right so there. Yup. Back up. There she here. is. Oh, I don't know how these guys are going to feel about filming, so we'll see how it goes here. We're going to pull and talk to these guys, and we'll see how it goes. If they're okay with filming, we'll roll film. Yep. See ya. Oh, no, it's not giving me the... Oh, there. It came on. Yeah, you have to... I had to I, uh, it's got to be filming to hit the button. Yeah, it does. So here it is. Oh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Beautiful. Man. Oh. Well, Owen, it's prettier than ours. It, it has all the teak on it still. It does have all the teak. Well, I have all the teak for mine. You do have all the teak for yours. Oh, comes with a battery. Yeah. And another battery. The Econo Power did not make it. <laughs> it was not Econo. It was. <laughs> it wasn't Econo. Yeah. So. Oh man. So. Did we turn the key off? It yes. is. It is off. Oddly enough, it does roll over and start with the key and the old six-year-old gas. It but, ran know. on the gas. Yeah. I yeah, mean, that's not me. a first. The truck had six-year-old gas. I'm it? sorry. You got to So, I did, did not much I could say. He's pushing the minivan with the Saturn. <laughs> Go help him. Go we'll see if he needs help. I can film myself. Hi guys. So, man, that bright, that light is bright. So, the guy's really nice. He's the same age as my mom. It's like 75 years old. He bought this boat originally. And yes, I'm sorry again, no microphones. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe so we can have microphones. Um, one owner boat. I have the title to prove it. I'll show you a picture of the issue date in 79. He is the original owner. Bought this boat brand new. I <clears throat> just talked to him for two hours. I really wish we had it all on tape. But to sum it up, just 
worked for Chrysler, just a hell of a nice guy. Uh, when you see this on YouTube, because we told him the name of the YouTube channel, thanks for the bubble. It's awesome. So it needs work. I mean, here you go. It, it needs seats. I mean, it, it needs the interior junk. It's had it. It's just, it's smoked. Motor rolled over, started right up, didn't knock. Um, I had to clean the points to get it to go. Um, we'll cover that here in a little bit tomorrow. For you guys, it'll be a minute. But, um, yeah, I mean, it's an all original one owner GMC Cobra Jet. Yes, it is rough, but the flip side of the coin is when Katie's done with the interior on this, it's going to be a brand new interior that'll be nicer and color matched to the boat. Probably blue and white like she did with mine. So it's going to be beautiful. And all the stuff that you need is here originally. When he bought the boat, it didn't have an hour meter. He taped an hour meter on it so he keep track of the hours. It's on there in the engine cover. I'll show you. Here's a picture of it. And uh, he said... <laughs> The tape just never, and I checked the tape's brittle. He's like, it just hung on there. He says, so I never took it off. He said, I just left on. So he put an hour meter on it when the boat wasn't brand new. It's got like 750 hours on it. And I can believe it. The way that motor fired right up, I can believe it. We had to clean the points. Once we got the points sparking, motor fired right up. Float stuck. Gas was shooting right out the top of the carburetor. He did, it's got a full tank, a six-year-old gas on it. Um, but he thinks he put stable in it, and I can believe he might have put stable in it because it did start up. I gave it a shot of ether, and that, and then it just kept running. It, we ran it for about 30 seconds, and the fuel's going all over. I'm like, hey, we better shut this down before we have a fire. So <laughs> there was that. Uh, we'll do we'll, we'll do a reenactment tomorrow. I'll, we'll fire it up before I clean the carburetor. You can see fuel fly everywhere. Maybe we'll burn the boat down. Probably not. So. Anyways, it's even on a tandem axle trailer. It's a little tandem axle trailer. And then Owen, Owen was moving the boat around by hand. It is dirty. It needs cleaning. And then the shift cable's bad. He ordered a brand new shift cable way back when. I don't know if we can find his date on here. I don't see, is there a date? I don't see a day. But he ordered a brand new shifter cable for the boat. So we got the, and look, he even wrote down the the 15 foot and Cobra Jet parts. How about that? So Teak's all in good shape. Trailer's in good shape. I mean, the only part of the boat that's not rotted, fuel tank had come loose on him once upon a time ago. So this is the forward bulkhead that goes up in the nose of the boat and the fuel tanks behind it. And he put it in the garage. And so that's still good. That's the only thing that's not rotted out. Man. So as soon as Owen gets back over here, there sits a Fiero. We'll get it hooked up. So that one's not killing you. So this is the owner of the 1979 Cobra Jet, and you bought it in? 1979, brand new. Brand new. Brand spanking new. And then you put, did you put the hour meter in that year then, or? I put it in the second day I had it. The second day you had it. I just it. taped it in, it was a temporary thing. <laughs> it's, it's still it's taped in there. there. That, that tape's crusty. Right, I mean, it's right. crusty. But it's worked, it's worked all these years. Yeah. It's been a good boat when I lived on a lake. I had a boat house and I actually had straps and I hoisted it right out of the water. So oh. it's, it didn't sit in the water. You can tell, which, it's, you know, it's gonna clean up nice. Yeah, it should. It's been a nice boat. Uh, I've never, never had insurance on it. <laughs> but the, thing, the difference is, is you can't let anybody drive it. Right. right. Now, I did let my kids take it a couple of times with very, very little. Right. Not on, on a lake that I live on, so, you know, it couldn't go anywhere. Yeah. But that yeah, was a good boat, and I hope it uh, serves you right. And oh, it's it's about to have its I'm second coming. Glad it started up. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry, you, you'll you see it on YouTube. Yeah. We'll, 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 when we get it up home tomorrow, 
we'll clean I'll pull the yep. car we'll go through for a couple hours we'll get water on it yep. and we'll get a video it should yep. be up and running and I'm gonna put a drain plug in it I don't know if there's I think there's one there but yeah anyway gotta have a drain plug one in. here you got us for a bit thank right. you thank you we, we I promise you the stories will only continue that's good except right. now they won't be like hey I heard about you know Joe's boat or whatever yeah. you know right. now they're gonna be yep. on video <laughs> All right. well, thank you that night go Michigan you might see a Fiero go by pulling a jet boat a jet boat Down with this guy down. with that guy driving yeah right yeah. there Vroom, vroom. Oh, an old over jet jet boat. Thing of beauty. Yeah, give me a brake light check on. Okay, now the real work begins, guys. We did get it fired off last night, but as you can see, ooh, brother, you think the Econo Power will take a charge? I don't think so. She's a little rough. But this is just a real quick short overview. Take a real good look. Because the next thing I'm going to do is fire up the pressure washer. Okay, step one, just clean the outside and uh, fiberglass on the inside to see what it looks like. And man, it needed a good cleaning. So there's going to be nothing to this boat. This one's going to be so easy, guys. Just scuff sand it with 400. Re-clear right over the old gel coat here. And then, uh, you know, just carpeting an interior. I mean, nothing to it. Boom, boom, boom. But man, it's going to be pretty. I'm so jealous. This thing is going to be freaking awesome. Oh, hey. There we go. You ready, Owen? Hell yeah. Oh, oh, I gotta get some ether in it. Okay. Hit it? Yeah, give it a try. Uh, I've seen it suck a little of that nasty old fuel. Dust cloud. Oh, give it a try. Try her again. All right, one more time. Oh, my God. <laughs> I mean, it is like... That's what fuel. I call fuel injection. Did you see it just boiling <laughs> up? I think we need to clean the carburetor. All right. Okay, the cleaning has begun. We got out the soap and the acid. And man, that old motor looks so much better. 
it hasn't shined like that since I would give it the benefit of the doubt 1982 maybe because <laughs> it must have shined like that in 1979 more to come guys <laughs> The smell of horsepower! No, the bright <laughs> flash of the paint! That was cool! Do it again! Like, subscribe, comment, and wait till you see that in my boat shooting flames. Yeah! Bye! <laughs>